if one were to bypass the thrift shop, they may think it's a quaint store for buying clothes and other items. But nearby business owners say over the past few weeks, there's been suspicious activity going on. It just didn't look right. It didn't, if you go into a store, you need to come out with some items. I mean, if you go in to buy something at old times to go and you don't come out with food, something's up. And officials with the Doherty County District Attorney's Office say that something was illegal gambling. There are at least six machines that have been seized along with the cash contained therein and uh, we will be going further in this investigation. District Attorney Greg Edwards says the slots were sectioned off in the back of the building with chairs and there were even refreshments to be sold. There were customers engaged in uh, this operation. Those persons that were here have been interviewed and released at this time. But the operations manager calls the raid a misunderstanding. The owner of the machines that were seized today say they are redemption machines that can be found all over the county. They say when people win, they receive gift cards or merchandise for their participation. As long as you are in accordance with the law, how you pay out of redemption, the machines are legal to have. Some people think it's just a facade nah. covering up a gambler. No, nah, it's, it's not at all that. All that is is just, a, it's just extra income that helps us sell our merchandise in the store. At this point, no one has been arrested, but officials say warrants will follow as the investigation continues. Jessica Fairley, Fox 31 News.